Hello, this is Smarter Prepping with Uncle Mark, and I'm Uncle Mark. The time is now about 10 minutes before 8 p.m. <clears throat> On Wednesday, the 16th of October, 2024. Once again, it is about 10 minutes before 8 p.m. On Wednesday, the 16th of October, 2024. I know it's so silly what I like to say. Besides that, it just... Oh, I just love fixating on it. So that's the day that it is. That's it. Okay, good. Now, here's the thing. I get a lot of free food. Okay? I keep wondering if anybody watching this is somebody that's... You know, that has watched a lot of my other videos. But anyway... I've been posting for about one year now. It's been almost a year. Anyway, I'm always getting free food, free food, free food from the neighbors, from whichever okay. And you see the, the cans toward the left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The seven cans that say Southgate, all beef chili with beans. So that's, you know, canned chili that most people in modern American culture are familiar with. It's Obviously, it's beef and beans. It says all beef means it's not some other kind of meat like turkey. So it's beef and beans and sauce and spices, including chili powder, right? Beef and beans, sauce, and spices. Now, I could just open a can of Southgate and eat that, eat half of it or all of it once each day, and then open a can and warm it up, eat it, open a can and warm it up and eat it, right? You see seven cans there, okay. So I did it seven different days, and it will be fine. And then those envelopes? That white and tan envelopes, that's also, a, it's a 15, each one, <laughs> that's three more 15 ounce cans, except instead of being a can, it's a, a foil and plastic envelope. I've gotten a lot of free food that way too. Okay, so, oh, that's also chili beef and beans. Okay, so, I could eat any of that just separate, you know, but I can't, blah, blah, blah. But Uncle Mark likes to do it different. And see, I also got for free. For free, I got six. See those big cans of beef? It says, Lakeside Beef with juices. It's got all the fat and juices. Oh, beef, fat, and juices. Good, good, good stuff. So I got three large cans. Okay. So what I decided to make, I decided to make some chili. It's going to be extra beefy. See, so this way, instead of eating that Southgate as is or that other... Food Life Balanced brand as is. I'm going to modify it. Oh, I'm going to make it interesting. Okay, okay. So I'll make it interesting. I'll add this beef, beefity beef, beef with juices. It's a beef, beef fat and juices. So it'll be more beefy with more beef fat and more juices. Tasty, tasty. With those three cans added. Then I decided to make the sauce in between the beef and beans more interesting. If you see toward that back row, the left, to the left says refried beans, and the two to the right are vine ripe diced tomatoes. So, see, that way the broth that's in between the beef and the beans would be more beany <laughs> and more tomatoey. Tomatoes will kind of water down the refried beans and be a kind of a sauce, a refried bean sauce with tomatoes in there, extra tomatoes. Chili sauce and seasoning has tomatoes in it. But I'm adding more tomatoes. Uh, more beans. Blah, 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 blah. So, of course, I'm doing that in this great big, I'm not going to swing my camera around. Kind of great big four-gallon pot. Oh, my gosh. So all that should fit easily in that four-gallon pot. We'll make about two gallons of Uncle Mark customized extra beefy, extra beany, extra tomato chili. <laughs> oh, plus I'll add some more chili powder. I have a spice uh, a tote, a clear tote down there full of spices. I'll add some more chili powder, and maybe I'll put in some sloppy mama on the back. But anyway, so we'll get it all fixed up. So, I'm always saying, every day, I'm, I just was talking with somebody here who was getting me involved with my health care plan. Um, I'm always telling her about people, uh, you know, people in my life who have, have, have died. I was in my father's hospital room when he died, okay. And Tanya died here in this apartment. But anyway, so I'm always talking about those people. Right, right, right. So 
Tanya died two and a half years ago. She liked to say later, Tater. So are you ready? Three, two, one. Later, Tater.